I had a family member or a relative or somebody who I was advising, I would absolutely encourage them to use Icobrain or a volumetric technique for every one of their scans. What we often miss in following MS patients is subtle changes that take place over the course of many years. So a lesion may start out this big, and then it's just very slightly bigger, and it's very slightly bigger, and it's very slightly bigger. And it's very difficult to go back and compare over time, whereas this is what Icobrain does very well. We get all of the data and all of the diagnostic ability that we get in a regular 3D brain for MS, plus we get the automated analysis, volumetric imaging, registration, and comparison uh, with Icobrain. I think if you're not ordering Icobrain for your MS patients, you may be leaving important information on the table. You're not only getting quantitative data, which was previously completely unavailable, but I think you're going to get a better diagnosis from the radiologist.